Hello Minecraft, uh, this is Maxwell Jones and uh, today we have a let's play. So let's create a new server or new world basically. It's on my local machine and let's call it Maxwell Jones. It's in survival so there will be some bad guys somewhere here and there. Alright, new seed, Maxwell Jones seed and Let's see what we get. Loading. I'm so excited. Oh, here we go. So it's looking pretty good. There is uh, some trees around. I can see some chickens already. And in a new game we always need some wood. So let's start and get some wood. So yeah. Hello chicken. A bit more and some more okay in this first episode we are really going to try to focus on what is tech it about trying not to die our first tree is down now let's make some planks a crafting table and to be sure we have enough wood let's make an axe So with our wooden axe, with this new mod, you can just cut the bottom part of the tree, of course. And the whole tree is going to come down. And the tree is falling at once. It's a bit longer to cut the tree, but it's really worth it. The everything's falling all at once, really good. So as I said, yeah, we are really going to try to focus on what is ticket, which means we are going to focus on machines, and I uh, hope you guys are going to have a great town. It's a solo mission. Let's see what we get then and where we get, how far, how long it takes. I will really try to rush it. So rush first to get a quarry. Because I'm not the guy who likes so, to mine so much. I don't like to die downstairs. Uh, and uh, I like to be here, like close to the snow and close to the forest. Make snowballs, have fun. No, just kidding. So, get some food, kill those chickens here, and get ready for a very early mining session. A bit more. Oh, come on, where are you? And yeah, you never know what you encounter down there when you're trying to get your first diamond, so it's better to have some food, just in case we have no more life and no more food. That's a very bad situation, which we will try to avoid. What, what I also like to do here in this new Tekkit mode um, is to use this uh, Ari minimap. I don't know, it's this thing showing on the, the minimap on the top right corner with a position which is like minus 29 and plus 251. But I don't really like to remember positions. So what I try to do is um, to set up a waypoint and you can have as many waypoints as you want and uh, if you never used it I'll show you how it works it's written on top here menu uh, PR press period key and then you can disable enable your minimap you can see the surface to show the biomes show the caves oh the caves wow this is new and this is really going to be useful very nice you can show your death point, so which is disabled by default. You should definitely show that and use it. And what I want to do is add a waypoint. Let's type spawn and press OK. Oh, all right, here we go. Here's the spawn waypoint. It's going to stay there the whole time. And doesn't matter how far we are, we are always going to see it. it means we can always come back. Let's go a bit further and see if we find some kind of cave or something like that, or just a hole going down. All right, I think we found a cave entrance. And yeah, it seems deep. It seems interesting. Let's make ourselves another crafting table because we just forgot the other one, which is fine. 
All right, the first wooden pickaxe to start with. And let's mine directly some some cobblestone here. Oh, it's a bit laggy. All right. I can hear the spiders already. So yeah, I'm gonna really try to make it safe. I can't promise I will not die, but I will do my best. And I'm also really going to try to rush it so we can really get to the interesting part as quick as possible. And I hit this, let's quickly change this pickaxe to a um, stone pickaxe. This wooden pickaxe is really a pain and uh, useful. Let's do directly three of those. All right. And I also want to have a sword just in case and trash this wooden pickaxe. Oh, I picked it up again. What the hell? Go away. I don't want that. So here's, what do we have here? Stone, copper. It's not going to be useful at the beginning, but later on. So I guess I um, shouldn't take too much of those and get to the most interesting part, which is finding the diamonds and setting up the quarry. So I'm going to try to be careful not to die. So dig carefully here make a kind of a staircase because it really seems to be deep and it's great it's really what I was looking for a deep cave wonderful very nice some more copper here but no we're going down we don't need that at the moment we are looking for a couple of diamonds and some gold and some iron of course also some sand but we'll find it later up Let's focus, first of all, on the diamonds. Because apparently it's the most difficult thing to find for you guys. And maybe you can see my technique and learn something, I don't know. And I need quickly to get some torches, first of all, because I don't see much of what's happening here. And I guess you guys neither. And it's safer when there are some torches. First of all, you know where you come from. And uh, yeah, the mobs are not spawning. First I want to cut this water source here. It's going to be easier to get down and maybe up. But I'm not really sure where I'm going to get up from this way. Doesn't matter. Let's build up a small staircase. Because I really don't want to fall down there. I hear the spiders. Must be some skeletons. Wow, it's going on down there. Look at that. Very nice. Okay, another block. And one more block. Great. Some lava. And. Right. Small staircase. Very nice lava fountain. And here's some coal. We can make some torches then. And I can hear some bad guys already there. So yeah, here's some iron. A couple of blocks. We will we're going to need quite some iron, I think, to start with. We need around about 35, 37, maybe 40. Let's make quickly some torches and light up the way. It's almost going down to bedrock. That's great. Oh, here we go. Hi, my friend. Come here. Gonna kill you. Thank you. All right, so this is definitely not safe and dangerous. I don't like that. Some mobs push me always into lava, and I'm the guy which is always falling in there, so I'm gonna make sure this doesn't happen, and 
put some cobble around it. Wow, it seems really big down there. Let's make a small staircase. Here and there. Right. And let's... Let's see. Where are the diamonds? That's the reason why we're here. Deep in the earth. So early game. Diamonds, gold. It's really necessary to start. And of course, I will need some more iron, which is basically standing right below me. All right. So yeah, we are level 15. This is also dangerous. Well, let's stop that. Okay. It is dangerous. And one more level down, 14. Mm. So we are already on the diamond level. Some quantum or I don't know what, oh, a creeper. Hi. Some redstone, wonderful. I also need some redstone. Put some more torches for some light so we can see the redstone. Oh, I, yeah. This pickaxe won't work for redstone. Uh, I, I guess it's time to set up a small base here. Make some space. Okay, another crafting table. And yeah, I'm missing some food already, so I guess I need to cook some chicken, eat, make a furnace, drop it there. Oh, just two coal, it's not much. Let's cook one chicken. And uh, yeah, let's try to cook the iron here and smelt it to get the ingots, because it's much more important than to eat somehow. We need the pickaxe. Oh, it's cooking. Let's see if we find some some coal. And oh, an archer. Hey, hello you. Oh, if it, I need to kill you, I guess, because you're shooting at me. Whoa. You're, hey, you're hurting. Hold on, I can't get to you. You're pushing me away the whole time. Oh my god, you get to me. Oh, one heart. No, no, ow. Okay. I died. All right. So I'm back at this bone. And let's quickly try to find a place we used to die. Or because we need to recover our stuff. That's really not a good beginning. But yeah, we have no armor. We are kind of Nick Creeper. Hello. Okay. Got some wood. Thank you, Mr. Creeper. Uh, is it? No, it's not the place I was going down. Doesn't look like. Let's go a bit further. Oh, Creeper. Let me run. Okay. This, this place is really full of holes. Doesn't really look that good. And where is my cave? I'm sure it was not so far away. Okay. Oh, here it is. Is it? I guess the entrance was on the other side here. Here is the one I was. Oh, yes. Let's get back downstairs. Oh, nice, I got some rubber on the way. This mod is really great, showing you the place you died. Easy to recover your stuff. This word first, the pickaxe. And let's climb back up there to get the rest of our gear. And yeah, here we go. I 
XP. Okay, I think we have everything we had. Wonderful. I really love those caves. They're really big. Dangerous, of course. Hey. Hello. Hello. There's a party somewhere. Yeah, well, that's why we're removing the lava. If we can. And let's see. Eight. Eight. What are we going to do with that? Let's change this word for an iron sword, which is going to be much better. I'll keep the stone one just in case. I want an iron pickaxe. And yeah, I'm going to keep them both and swap between both of them. The iron pickaxe is going to be useful. All right, to main this, for example. And we have... Yeah, let's use this till the end and make a bucket. Because this is definitely the safe way to go in a cave. You need a bucket and some water. So I can see some water here. Let's find the source. Where is the source block? Must be down there somewhere. So we'll dig a little bit to find it. Mm, maybe here? No? Yeah. This is looking... Yeah, that's the one. Here we go. Pick it up. Great. Back at the water. Really important. Pick it up. Just drop it there. And it's really useful. Oh, spider. Hello. Thank you. She didn't really like the water. Let's place some torches so we can see something. All right. Here one. And let's explore a little bit. Water is really great to stop the lava. Oh, look at that. It's looking like diamonds already. Oh, that's really quick. Is it? Yes, ladies and gentlemen, here are first two diamonds. Wonderful. Great. Let's go on now. We need some more. We need basically 11 for what we want to do. 11 diamonds and then we are not going to need to go down in the mine anymore. That's the whole point about it. Whoa, whoa, that was unexpected. Uh, it's better not to fall in there with the diamonds in their hand. Because they would just burn and disappear, which is really not what we're looking for. This would be really dramatic. All right, let's go this way, put some light, and here is another cave. Okay, this is not diamond. Oh, I left some ore here, gold. Let's take some more coal in case we need some more torches on the way. Coal is never lost anyway. With this new ticket you need loads of coal, or at least a big source of energy, doesn't matter if it's coal or whatsoever, nuclear maybe. Yeah, let's not dream. We are at the very beginning. We are mining our first diamonds and we are really not there yet. So let's focus on what is really important here, the diamonds. So I'm now level 14. Level 14 is basically where you get the most diamonds, or the most chance to get some diamonds. And basically, yeah, let's see if we get somewhere, another cave, a link to something here. So yeah, that's really the way I used to go the whole time, get back to level like 12, 13 or 14 and see what we get, but basically yeah, you spend a lot of time mining straight forward, trying to find the next cave. And if you don't have a spawner or mob behind, it's going to be really difficult. I want to test with you this new thing with the race minimap. And here we can show the cave. So, all right, I'm able to see the caves here. Is it true? Yes. Yeah, that's the cave I'm in. I can see it this way and that way. All right, and if I follow this one, there is a cave network here, which I didn't really see because there was no light and uh, yeah, I was not aware I was focusing on my diamonds. So 
It's perfect. It's really useful. Okay, it's going up. I don't like this that much. Some lapis. Yeah, let's take it. We we don't know if we're going to need this quick or not, but yeah, I'll just let, take a few pieces. Some more iron. All right. I want to know to that. And yeah, here's the new cave. Oh yeah, this minimap is really, really cool. Oh, a spider died here. Some more coal, some more lava. It's I'm a little bit lost, but does it matter? No, it doesn't matter. I guess it's completely okay. I have my waypoint set. So it's fine being lost. Just get rid of the lava. Hello, hi. Can I try to push you in the lava? Oh, you died too early. Didn't make it to the lava. Okay, maybe your friend. Next one. As long as you guys don't push me in the lava, I'm gonna be fine. So, lots of mobs here. Some gold up there. But I'm mainly looking for the diamond, so let's go on. We're level 11, it's really the right place to find some diamonds. They just need to show up. Oh. Yes. They're really hidden, those guys. One, two, three, four, five, and six. Six together with the two we got before, that's eight diamonds at the moment. So we need 11 for our first quarry. And we are going to try to get the last three. Yeah, so it's starting pretty well. Like 20 minutes of game and already eight diamonds. Maybe we won't need more than half an hour to get all of them. It seems here it doesn't go any further. Okay, some more redstone. Doesn't hurt. And what's there? I didn't check this direction here. So, this not much. Okay, another lava lake. Oh, very tiny one. Okay. We had some cooked meat here. It's pretty useful. Still hungry. I wish to have a little more to reach in my life, but it seems that's not possible right now. Okay, that's the place I've been before. That's where I came in. Oh, hello you. How are you doing? Oh, you gone already. So, I guess if you're careful enough, you don't really need to die on your first day mining. Hey, there must be a spawner here somewhere. Oh God, the archer. No. Let's go away. Oh, let's close that quick, quick. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, no. Oh, oh, okay. Whoa, that was hot and tight. Okay. Let's break some light and grab some food, whatever we get. Some rotten flesh. Mmm. It really tastes wonderful. So, yeah, as you can see, I'm rushing a little bit, uh, but yeah, I think it's worth it. Got eight diamonds already, and we are really on the way, not spending too much time. Of course, you, oh, a creeper here. Of course, you need to be careful what you do, how you do it, especially with the lava. I would really recommend you take a bucket, and yeah, those skeletons are really painful. They They hurt. They hurt. The zombies are okay, but the skeletons, they shoot you from really far away and they hurt. So where we go? This way? 
No, that's not diamond. There's a big lake of lava here. Let's try to go over the lake. The creeper hopefully is not going to try to cross the lava to get me. I'm gonna try to go there. So that doesn't look like diamond. No. So, come on, Diamond. Where are you? Not here. Redstone. Another friend. Hi. You want to swim? Oh, you have a very strange head. You look like a poor villager, man. Okay, you're going to swim. Have fun. Oh, he couldn't swim into lava. Sorry. Yeah. I guess if you're careful enough mining at those levels it's not too dangerous because basically you mainly don't have lava oh some ferrous you don't have lava falling over your head it's basically down there it's level 12, 13 it's difficult to find lava under and you're not going to really to dig down and if you do so be careful place some water or just check before and just don't dig on the block you're sitting on this would be a really bad idea all right some more rotten flesh I don't care so much for eight at the moment. Uh, what is important here is to mine the last diamonds that are missing for the recipe. And um, we're going to find them. It seems not in here. So, where are we going now? Let's look at the mini map again. Going around, what's up and down. Uh, let's see, I guess there is a lake here behind and we can go further. So let's see. Let's go across here. In this direction there should be something not so far away. All right, some light. Yes. Light means lava here. Great. A torch, maybe some diamonds, no, ferrous here, stone, ore, but no diamond. Let's head back here. Oh, this map is really, really useful. I'm very happy I enabled it. And let's check what we have behind here. Okay, another cave, just like on the mini-map. And it seems to... Oh yeah, that's where I've been. It seems the creeper's gone. He despawned, which is good for us. So, nothing here. Nothing there. Come on. Oh! The creeper's still there. But he's not gonna go across the lava to catch us. So it's pretty safe. Yep, I could hear you. But the, no, 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 die, die, I don't like you. All right, some more rotten flesh. Oh, look at that, a carrot, great. We, we are going to be able to get some pigs sometime. Because basically the pigs are my favorites. It's not really the favorite meat to eat. Because I like the ingots, the meat ingots. But the pigs are, are, I think they are the best animals. They are basically the most silent animals, not like those chickens which are horribly loud. And here I see from my mini map there is something behind. Wow, it's very useful. It's just amazing. There is no other words, it's amazing, really. Okay, 
and it's going on. I would like to get to this big cave I see on my minimap. Let's see. Here. Must be there, this big cave in this direction. So, level 11, we have all of the chances to find some more diamonds. So I guess you're going to ask me, hey, why do you leave so many things on the way? Why do you leave some more, so much copper, so much iron? And basically, yeah, I just want to find out the diamonds and the necessary items for my recipes. Because I plan to build a quarry, a planter, a harvester and some sterling engines. Because, yeah, it's already half an hour. I'm trying to rush my diamonds and... Oh, yeah, here we go. Diamonds. I guess it's the last three diamonds here. Great. The quest seems to be close to be finished. Just want to secure a little bit, because you never know what's going to be happening here. Need some more torches. Right. One... Two and oh no, it's just ten. I need eleven. All right, so bad news the quest goes on. A bit water here, a bit water there. Mm, looks like silver. Oh, creeper, hello. Come on, I'm going to punch you, and one more time, and you're dead. So, diamond, 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 I want some diamond. So, if somebody would compose a song for me about diamonds, it would be really lovely. Something, you know, really easy to remember. very good what we call light motif about diamonds so silver and here's a dead end apparently and a dangerous one and looking at my map it's going on here yep let's see on the other side oh i think i see diamonds just there let's double check that And hopefully, yes! Yeah, we go. One. Okay, that's enough. We don't need more. But still, I'm gonna take them. Never spit on diamonds, man. And one more. Wow. Wonderful. That's it. So now it's time to get back up. Uh, I didn't double check uh, what I have in my inventory um, still it's time to get back up but uh, I want to be sure I have enough gold and enough iron let's double check that so 16 diamonds which is more than enough we just need 11 we have 11 gold which is fine 28 redstone okay 20 iron. Oh, okay, that's where we missed some. I, I I thought we need around about 40, like 37, I think is the minimum. And we will also need some sand and some clay, which we will need to find in, in the lakes or in the rivers. So let's kick out some cobble, which we don't need actually. And let's get back up. On the way up, we will try to get some of the iron we're missing. Is that a nice way to get back up? Oh no, it's looking pretty dangerous here. Let's choose another way. Maybe the way I came from. It's not so bad. I think it was here. Hmm some silver okay let's take a few things on the way back we're happy we have everything let's take a few things but let's not take too many risks 
because we are so quickly dead. We have no armor. We're kind of naked. And I wouldn't like to die and lose some or all of my diamonds. And let's head back to the light. It's pretty dark here. Okay, here's some of the iron I'm looking for. So we're level 23 already. If I remember well, the top is like 50 or 56. And I think I came from... Okay, iron more. I have the feeling... I've been across here, or maybe not. Oh, I don't know, and actually... Doesn't matter, I know. That's not the way I came from, but it's going up, so... Let's follow. Let's see where we head. Okay, no, I definitely haven't been there. Let's pick the iron here. Oh, come on. Okay. All right. Some more iron. I can hear some spiders, which is not a good noise. It's gonna be tough, and I'm still hungry. No food left, or no quick food, and um, I don't want to waste my chickens. So, oh, another party here. Let's kill them. No party anymore. Party's forbidden. Oh. Hey. Did he just push me? Okay, something we can eat. At least gonna be good for a while. Let's quickly check how much... 33. I said we need about 37 di uh, iron. Hopefully we find it on the way up. Let's see. No, not here. Hmm. Okay. Here we go. All right. So I hope I was counting well. We have just, I think, 37. Let's get back up. Yeah, I guess we're going to do staircase here. I don't want to lose too much time and take too many risks going into left and right and you know I can see my markers I'm never going to be lost so yeah the spawn is 44 meters away and getting closer every time so no, that's gonna be the easiest way let's take the copper on the way all right Level 50... Oh, water? Yeah, sure. I was spawning next to a river, so I guess... I'm not trying the right side of the minimap, I don't see where I am, but it sounds like an exit. All right. Let's see if we have enough air to get out there. Yes, we are out. Surface, but... Not so far away from the spawn, but it's still night here. It's... Yeah. Oh, a red battery. It's gonna be useful later. Let's put up some torches around. So, they won't spawn next to me anymore. Oh, creepers. Uh, yeah, my... My sword is almost broken. I shouldn't really try to fight any mob at the moment. I should just try to save the stuff I have, just in case. Head to the spawn, light up a little bit. And look at that, down is coming, the sky is red. Great, that's all what we need here. A little bit of daylight, we've been so long in the cave. So, let's make a chest. And store of stuff. Got some sand on the way, which is just great. 
Here we go, let's put our step inside. Some ferrous ore, silver ore, gold ore, iron, 37, oh wow, copper, redstone, our diamonds, carrots, and the meat I will cook. And I think everything else I can just pop in the chest. All right. So, everything's in the chest. Thanks for watching. And um, if you want another episode, um, let me know. It uh, would be great to do another one. Uh, and let's see how this quarry works. Take care. <laughs>